Humidity sensors. These sensors bring the capability of sensing humidity RH level in air for smart home. The accuracy and sensing precision depend on a lot on multiple factors including the overall sensor design and placement. But certain sensors like DHT22 and DHT11 built for rapid prototyping would always perform poorly when compared to high quality sensor like HIH6100 and DRH. So if we use for prototype then you can use DHT22 and DHT11 sensor. It's quite good. While building a proto product to sense humidity levels ensure that there is no logical layer of humidity that is obscuring the actual result. Also keep into consideration that in certain small species the humidity might be too high at one end as compared to other end. So humidity sensors just measure the humidity of the environment and you should use as per your application. Now come on lux sensors. Lux sensors measure the luminosity and can be used to trigger various functions range from cross validating moment to turn the light on if it becomes too dark. Some of the most popular light sensors are TSL2591 and BH1750. Recent tests include TSL2591 and BH1750 into low powered IoT device have found them to be working fairly good for the most of the use cases because most of the IoT op devices are battery operated so we always look after the consumption of the battery and it should be minimum for more duration to work. Water level sensors while building your prototype you may consider a solid state tape liquid level sensor or like others who just use an HSC SR05 ultrasonic sensor to measure the water level sensor. Float level sensors and other ICs like LM1830 offers a more precise measurement capacity to IoT developers. So I'm saying again choose your sensors as per your application. There's so many type of sensors available and they are cheap also. Now we come across sound detection sensor. Sound detection sensor plays a vital role from monitoring babies to turning on and off lights automatically to automatically detecting your dog sound at the door and opening it for them. Some commonly used sensor that you can use for sound detection includes SEN12462 and EasyVR Shield for rapid prototyping. These sensors are not as good as an industrial grade sensor like those from 3D signals which can detect even ultra low levels of noise and fine tune between various noise levels to build even machine breakup pattern. So if you are going to use sound reduction sensors, use as per your application. For prototyping, you can use SEN12462 and EasyVR. But for more accuracy you can use for other industrial sensors.